let's get into that when what it means. So, this is our example. Uh, I had some good questions, uh, or a good question, on how do you find center of pipe? Um, or how do you measure from center of pipe when you're looking for, let's say you're doing this as waste pipe. It has to fall at a grade. So that grade, depending on different sizes of pipe per code, uh, let's say it needs to fall at a quarter inch per foot at four feet times 0.25 is one inch of fall. If you do, say, an eighth of an inch, you have four feet times an eighth of an inch equals half an inch per foot. So when we're talking per foot, um, let's say this is your concrete ground right here. Uh, this is your first floor. So you need to figure out a measurement. So you're going to get usually a BOP from Prince uh, measuring, say, we want the bottom of pipe to be at such and such a measurement. Um, so once you establish where you need to be, um, it's always easy or easiest, but there's a couple of different methods and styles that people use because um, generally ground um, or floors are not going to be even. There's going to have slope to them or the concrete weight might be different and uh, this floor might be different. Um, so this is one way to do it, but there's many ways to do it. So say you pull your measurement from the floor um, to the ceiling and then you do what you need for bottom of pipe. Okay, so you get that measurement. You're going to pull and then you say this is, let's just say this is a four foot stick of pipe. So if you're at nine foot um, even, um, in four feet, technically that center of pipe would be nine foot even, and then this center of pipe would be one inch less than that, so you'd be at eight foot eleven here. So that's what that's what grade means. So four feet times quarter inch per foot of this pipe. So if you have, if you got to think, this is four. Oops, I jacked that up. So every foot of this pipe needs to be falling at a quarter inch. Um, so if it was four feet at an eighth of an inch, this would, this this center, nine foot would be the start of the bottom of pipe, or let's say center, and then center would be eight foot 11 and a half over here. So the way that you would pull that, um, a lot of the times you could go, so measure nine foot to here, and then measure over to here, because then you have to have hanger spacing, and that depends on your piping, depends on your code, depends on what, what you're running, um, and, but this is, this is usually graded on its own hangers if it's waste pipe. So you, what I would do though is usually setting a benchmark um, off of a column so you would put like a laser here you would measure here because you're not going to finish the whole project of making you're not just going to install a four foot piece of pipe you're going to install hundreds of feet of pipe um, you're going to be installing um, like I said hundreds of feet of pipe so you need to set a good benchmark you can't just pull from this this area over here on the floor because that could be different from here over here on this floor and this could be different up here the measurement here versus the measurement over here so usually setting a benchmark um, and putting a laser uh, is usually at the same spot every day so that way you can measure let's say your bottom of pipe needs to start at nine foot you set that laser at nine foot um, and then once you set your first hanger a lot of the times what we do is a story pull so once you start setting the hangers you set one hanger here and some people will use um, a conduit uh, which is a really nice piece of usually it needs to be straight obviously so you not now imagine that that pipes not there yet because you need to get your hangers first uh, you set that hanger you put a story pull a piece of conduit you pull your measurement because this or you put your uh, grade level on there and your grade level is going to show you a quarter inch so say this is PVC and you have to go every four feet you put another hanger here four feet away and then you'd measure uh, this piece of pipe right here with your grade level and that needs to say let's say it's two inch in my area that's a quarter inch per foot um, and then you'd see that on your grade level and then you just kind of put that story pull and move it in and then you, this is this starts from layout um, and so there's a lot of steps to before you get to know how to set these hangers properly so I don't know if that makes sense but hopefully that uh, resonates on how you need to be setting your grade. Center is always center. See, center is always center. Bottom is always bottom. So I always pull one measurement from there, and then there's different methods as to best practice what it is that you're about to install.